If you're like me, you're probably wondering if you're making learning fun enough for your little one and if they're really developing a true love for learning. Today, you'll get six fun and interactive letter activities you can do with your preschooler or toddler. Hi there, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ashley. I am a stay-at-home mama to a 14-month-old son and a three-and-a-half-year-old daughter. And today, I'll be sharing six fun games and activities that focus on letter recognition. These activities are great for learning new letters and sounds or reviewing letters and sounds if your preschooler is ready to start reading. And if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see that we already did some of these activities in our Chicka Chicka Boom Boom themed week. And let me tell you, it was a lot of fun. It was a good week. So let's just get into it. This activity, you're gonna need dot stickers. I bought all of mine on Amazon and I use them for so many activities. First, you're gonna write the alphabet scattered out of order on a piece of paper. And I usually make the letters small enough so that it can be completely covered by a sticker. However, if you have a young toddler just learning their letters, feel free to make them bigger and use sticky notes instead. Remember, you can always manipulate any activity so that it fits your child's learning style. Next, you're gonna write the matching letters on the dot stickers. You can make them all caps or lowercase, and if you wanna challenge them, you can write capital letters on the stickers to match the lowercase letters on the paper, and vice versa. Now the fun begins. Help your child match the letters and make sure you're teaching them along the way. It's a great activity to practice letter sounds too. Also, if your child is old enough to peel the stickers off, it's a great way to practice those fine motor skills that will prepare them to write those letters one day. This letter recognition activity is the easiest to set up. You just need a piece of paper and some markers. Choose what letter you want to focus on. The week we did this activity, we were focusing on the letter C for coconut. Write several of the specific letters you chose and write other letters around them. I like to use different colored markers to make it bright and fun for her. Then it's time for your little one to find each of the intended letters and circle it. If your child is too young to circle, go ahead and have them color on top of the letter or put a sticker on it. You can manipulate this activity however you need to to fit your little one's developmental stage. So you can show them a flashcard of the letter C and ask them to find it, or you can give them verbal directions, or you can even have them find the letter based on their sound. Like, find the letter that says k, -k. Since we had a Chicka Chicka Boom Boom themed week, I thought it would be fun to make a quick coconut tree and have my preschooler reenact the book with our fridge magnets. She actually loved this activity more than I thought she would. To make the tree, just cut out four large half circles for the leaves and one or two brown rectangles for the trunk. And I quickly taped them together. You'll also need a Chicka Chicka Boom Boom book and any letters you have on hand. I decided to use our fridge magnets, but you can use puzzle pieces, flashcards, or anything you have. After putting the tree together on the floor, we got started. I started reading the story and she would find the letters and reenact what was happening in the book. This was a great way of mixing in learning with dramatic play. Then after we finished the story, we came up with another game. Together, we thought of different verbs for each letter sound. For example, I grabbed the G and I said, I'm gonna g g gallop up the coconut tree. And she would grab the R and say, I'm r r running up the coconut tree. It was a perfect game for practicing phonics. Then of course, I let her play with the set on her own and let her use her imagination. If you're getting value out of this, no, no, no. Oh my gosh, my tongue. If you're getting value out of this video, please hit that like button and let me know down in the comments how you like to teach letters to your little one. This was another popular letter activity that kept my preschooler entertained for hours. My 14 month old even got in on the action. Just pull out that box of Play-Doh and find letters that will be good for stamping. I used our chunky letter puzzle pieces, but I'm sure the fridge magnets would have worked too. Then all you have to do is let them have fun. This is a great hands-on way of teaching the alphabet. It would also be a great tool for teaching CVC words, and it's fun watching the way they use their imaginations to play. This letter scavenger hunt is perfect for those little ones that like to move. You just need sticky notes and a pen, and if you'd like, letters to put up to match with the sticky note letters. You can write letters on paper and tape it up to the wall, but I thought it would be fun to use our letter magnets. Just write a letter on each sticky note and hide them around the room or the whole house if you'd like. Then you can ask them to find a specific letter, like they're hunting for it. Or what I did was let my preschooler choose what letter to find and match. My daughter spent 20 minutes searching for letters and sticking them under the matching fridge letters. This game is a favorite in our house. She never gets tired of this game and we both love that she can run around and get her wiggles out all while learning her letters. 
This letter activity is played with in a sensory bin. You'll need beans, rice, corn, or whatever sensory bin filler you have. Tangible letters like puzzle pieces and either a spoon or large tweezers, whatever your child prefers. Then you're gonna hide the letters in the beans so that your little one can dig and find them. My preschooler was honing in on those fine motor skills as she was picking up the letters with the tweezers, which I believe I bought from the Dollar Tree, by the way. She was pretending she was capturing each letter and putting them in their cage, also known as the puzzle board. She was having fun playing and had no idea she was learning so much from this activity. So there you have it, six fun, easy, and hands-on letter activities that feel more like playing than learning. Please don't forget to like this video if you got value from it, and please subscribe if you want to know more tricks and tips on how to encourage a love of learning in your preschooler or toddler. I post a video every Tuesday, and I like to share resources for moms like you, how to teach your child in a fun and playful way at home. Also, come say hi to me on Instagram. I share our themed weeks and activities, and I would love to get to know you and your homeschooling journey. So see you next time. Bye-bye.